Gamer. What's going on guys, MD here from Sports Gamers Online and today just a quick how-to and tutorial on how to add custom music in MLB The Show 17. Now a lot of games in this current generation of the PS4 and Xbox One don't allow custom music because the consoles don't really allow ripping, but MLB The Show 17 can let you bring in your own music provided you have a flash drive and add it to the game for use in stadiums, chants, yells, assign it to players, even background menu music. Now to do this before you do anything in the game, you need a flash drive that has a folder in it called music. That's all it has to be. And then you just have to add the mp3s that you want to import into that folder. So once you do that, you have your USB attached to your PS4, you're going to go to sounds of the show in the options menu, then you're going to go down to the bottom right, select manage music files, and when that pops up, you're going to hit import music. It's going to pick up what USB storage device you want to use, you select it, and then it will process the songs for you or the files that you want to bring in. Depending on how big the files and how many determines how long it takes, but it doesn't really take too long, actually. It's actually, it's pretty quick. So six in. So you have them. Now what do you want to do? So you're going to go to Jukebox, and you can do a custom playlist this way, or you can just go to Playlist Creator from this menu. It's quicker this way, obviously. If you want it to be in the menu, you go to Jukebox Editions, then you choose the songs that you want and they'll be there so you have your music there they'll be in your menus as you can see I'll leave them in the jukebox go back go to the jukebox and the songs are here in the bottom you want to use them in stadiums you can do music editor which allows you to cut and trim the tracks for use in stadiums or with players you can do chants if you have some chant mp3 you want to bring in or yells if you want to bring those in but you have to put it in the respective thing so say we want to do some music editor we will bring leave in over it's there we'll back out we'll go to the music editor and if you go to the next page you can see it's here at the bottom and this editor allows you to set marks and points and choose how long the song is going to be and when you want to assign the audio you can either assign it to a team or a specific player We'll do Joey Votto from the Reds, edit his walk-up music, and Levin is there at the bottom of the page. And you can preview it to make sure it's what you want. And that's pretty much it. If you like this video and you want to see more and you like all our other videos, hit that like button. Be sure to subscribe to Sports Gamers Online. Until next time, I'm out.